My name is Dave Lambert. I am Creative Director of Brass, and we are an independent multi child communications agency based in Leeds. For just over 20 years now. My current role, I've been here five months, and before that, I was Creative Director of Momentum in Manchester for just over six years. first job in the industry. It's going back to when I was 20 years old. We did seven months placement at Steel Price Lintas and we uh, got offered a job after that long period of time on £40 a week I believe it was. The things I find the most rewarding is actually um, when as a team, as a, as a collaborative approach, we, we actually win, we succeed, we get some great work out, we get an existing client to buy a great campaign, we, we win a new bit of business that everybody is really exciting and, and sort of proud of. Uh, they're the sort of things that really keep me going. I still get that buzz even now, 20 years into the business. Um, making sure I'm delivering the best possible creative work for all clients. Making sure we're winning pitches, getting on pitch lists, getting the best out of myself and the team, and just getting excellence at the front of everything we do. So they're, they're, they're the, the sort of things that are commonly on my mind at night time. I would say the industry has changed to some degree. Uh, I think the, the way in which media and, and multi-channel has just exploded um, uh, exponentially. I don't think there is one way of doing a TV spot and that's it anymore. I think it, it is a very multi-channel approach which is needed. But I would say what I've noticed in recent times is that the dogged determination desire that where teams you would think come back again and again and again with new work, new a new book. That hasn't happened. And that's something that, if I'm absolutely honest with you, disappoints me a little bit because I know how hard it can be and I'll do everything I can as an individual to support the people who come to see me because I will always try and give back because I haven't forgotten just what it was like, even though it's 20 years later. What my advice would be is you have to stay true. Gain the, gain the comments and you know, from the people you believe are the right people. Don't see too many people. You have to see a set amount. Go to the people you truly value their opinions for. Form your book from that and your own good feeling and knowledge and have that self-belief. That's what I would say to anybody. I've run quite several uh, DNAD Northern workshops and done lecturing and various things. And what I would say with my observations with all that is that I think there's some real energy and enthusiasm out there. There's always, naturally, each year you'll have bright individuals, but it's that desire to sort of keep going back and not be knocked down, not be deterred. You have to have that resilience. And I think that's the core thing that the ones that succeed, the ones I always noticed in, the, in recent times, are the ones who are just, they are, that you, you knock them down, they come back stronger and they have that inner, inner belief in themselves. So that is the one thing I would always say, always believe in yourselves because that will influence others to believe in you.